Hi, Jay Foster for Health Connection Radio and Body Chemistry Associates. Today I want to tell you about the trace element selenium. Very, very important in cancer prevention, important for your thyroid, important for your heart, important to protect against and remove toxic metals. But on cancer prevention, selenium has a long history of research. Um, in fact, if uh, today, which is the 2nd of uh, January 2018, if you go to pubmed.gov, G-O-V, pubmed.gov, that's the service of the National Library of Medicine and National Institute of Health, and they really only have good, solid, peer-reviewed medical and scientific journals. So if you type in cancer prevention you'll get back uh, quite a few studies that your oncologist and your medical doctor may not know about. Is it four studies, 404 or 1,404? And that's the number, 1,400, over 1,000, 1,400, 1,000 um, uh, articles. Uh, in the, you can just assume there's at least 1,000 good articles in there. Uh, about cancer prevention. One from way back, I remember actually the interview on this, uh, December 25th, Christmas Day, 1996, was published in the Journal of the American Medical Association, JAMA. We're not talking about a fly-by-night hippie health food store journal, as I often say. Uh, this is a reputable peer-reviewed medical journal, JAMA. Uh, Dr. Larry Clark of the University of Arizona Cancer Center announced in JAMA, December 25th, 1996, that supplementing the diet with 200 micrograms of selenium per day, that's MCG, dramatically reduced the incidence of cancer. He had over 1,300 volunteers take 200 micrograms of selenium for an average of about four and a half years. And those groups that took selenium had a 37% decrease in overall cancer incidence compared to those who did not take selenium, the controls. They had a 50% decrease in cancer-related deaths. In four and a half years, they cut their death rate from cancer in half with a cheap, crummy little trace element called selenium. Within that group, they had decreases in breast cancer. They had a 63% decrease in prostate cancer, a 58% decrease in colorectal cancer, and a 46% decrease in lung cancer. And guess what, folks? No prescription drug uh, then or now can claim these kind of results. But selenium can't. Now, recently, Dr. Oz came on and held up two Brazil nuts and said if uh, everyone in the country ate two Brazil nuts a day, they would uh, get enough selenium to prevent cancer. Well, that's assuming that all the Brazil nuts have exactly amount of 200 micrograms of selenium in two, and you cannot guarantee that. And this is such an important, uh, groundbreaking study, and there's 1,403 more. Here's one more recent one from December of 2017, that's last month, Optimizing Selenium for Modulation of Cancer Treatments. Talk about selenium being an essential mineral. It says, um, extensive study of selenium compounds has demonstrated growth inhibition of malignant cells in a vast array of experimental models. This is written up in a journal called Anti-Cancer Research, December of 2017. Not too bad for a recent study. And besides those two I just read you, there are 1,402 more that talk about selenium being useful in cancer prevention. Why have you not heard about it? Because there's no money in it. Selenium is way too cheap, and if it prevents cancer, you're going to put somebody out of business. You don't want to do that. So we test for selenium in our body chem programs, as we do for other trace elements, to find out what... Uh, might be the cause for certain symptoms or conditions in the body. In the thyroid, selenium is uh, required for an enzyme that converts T4, thyroxin, into T3, which is more powerful. You have a selenium deficiency, even if you're taking something like Synthroid or uh, levothyroxine, it may not do the job if you don't have adequate amounts of selenium. 
Selenium's important in the heart. There was a whole study on Kishan's disease and others in developmental uh, cardiology. And also protects against mercury, lead, aluminum, and cadmium. Selenium helps to combine and uh, block those absorption of those toxic metals as well as um, uh, prevent them, uh, not only preventing them from coming in, but also helping to remove them. So we do tests for all those, uh, toxic metals for selenium, for other trace elements in our body chem program. We've been doing it for 36 years at Body Chemistry Associates. If you want some more information on that, give us a call, 1-800-CHEMIST, 1-800-243-6478. On Facebook, uh, Body Chemistry Associates, 30 six years in South Florida doing this work and we work all over the country and have uh, testing uh, done on people sent in from other countries as well. 1-800-CHEMIST, 1-800-243-6478 on the web, 1-800-CHEMIST.com. Jay Foster on Health Connection Radio for Body Chemistry Associates. We'll be back soon with another podcast.